Linda McMahon comments on Vince McMahon's retirement from WWE. WWE NXT expected to somewhat return to Triple H's previous vision. Triple H also says it will take a team of people to fill Vince McMahon's shoes. Naomi appearance announced for C2E2 convention. What's up guys, it's Denise Salcedo and you're watching the latest. Here is your daily news rundown. Linda McMahon has given her first public comments about Vince McMahon's retirement from WWE. At an event for the America First Policy Institute, Linda fended off questions from a reporter about Vince McMahon's retirement. When the subject was brought up, Linda attempted to shut down the line of questioning. Well, the biggest story right now with Vince leaving WWE, what, yeah, what are your thoughts? I'm not going to talk about Vince and WWE, I'm here to talk about AFPI. The reporter continued to ask about the issue, asking Linda what her thoughts were on Vince deciding to retire. He'll just be deciding on how he's going to spend his free time. The reporter then asked Linda if she was concerned about Vince being investigated for his alleged hush money agreements, in which Linda responded no. Are you concerned at all about the investigation? No. The hush money? Come on. So I told you I'm here to talk about AFPI. Amid a sexual misconduct scandal, Vince McMahon announced his retirement from WWE on July 22nd. Vince McMahon's retirement came after the Wall Street Journal reported that he had agreed to pay more than $12 million over the past 16 years to suppress allegations of sexual misconduct and infidelity. All four women were formally affiliated with the company. Linda McMahon is the chair of the America First Policy Institute, a political organization that aligns with Donald Trump. Linda resigned from Trump's cabinet in March 2019 to become the chair of the America First Action Super PAC. With Vince McMahon out of power, there's an expectation that WWE NXT will somewhat return to Triple H's previous vision for the brand. In his cover story on McMahon's retirement in this week's Wrestling Observer Newsletter, Dave Meltzer reported that there's a belief in NXT that the product will revert back somewhat to Levesque's previous vision. Meltzer noted that it's believed NXT will continue to heavily recruit top-tier athletes, but it will be more open to using experienced pro wrestling talent as well. NXT changed from its previous black and gold identity to NXT 2.0 in September 2021. The rebrand has seen NXT focus on younger and less experienced talent, with WWE signing more college athletes and former college athletes instead of established independent wrestlers. Levesque noted that the intent of the new management team is to take WWE to new levels and beyond where it is now, saying, quote, There are a massive pair of shoes to fill that I'm trying in some way to step into, but I do not dream for one second that I can fill those shoes by myself. It's going to take a lot of us. It's going to take a team. It's going to take everybody here to fill those shoes and continue this on, but we will. The intent is to continue the legacy of what has been going on, what made me fall in love with this business that he created, and to take it to new levels and take it beyond where it is now. Triple H also noted that he has a clean bill of health and is motivated to continue in his new role. I have a new appreciation for life. It's precious. It doesn't last long. Embrace it. Get everything you can out of it, said Triple H. C2E2 announced on Friday that Naomi, billed under her real name Trinity Fatu, will be a guest at their convention on Saturday, August 6th and Sunday, August 7th. It was also announced earlier this month that Banks will be appearing at the convention. This will be the first public appearance Naomi and Banks have made since walking out of WWE. That's a wrap for today's video. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button. F4W Online is almost at 100,000 subscribers and we need you to hit that goal. So make sure to click that subscribe button. Other than that, you can hit me up on Twitter and or on Instagram at underscore Denise Salcedo to chat more wrestling. And I'll see you guys on the next video.